Hi there guys, my name is David and you're watching Viva La Automotive and today is my second day out here in Monaco and I have to admit it's not the fastest of the start because it's already 11 a.m. in the morning and um, yeah, I just about came here to Central. My friend Amon, who you may have seen in yesterday's vlog, uh, went for a morning walk and he was able to see a red 918 Spider, which just cruised past him. So hopefully I'll be able to see some similar sort of hypercars or just some other interesting vehicles. But that's enough talking for now. I think I'm going to head to the roundabout or the Fairmont Hairpin and uh, hopefully see some cars. I started my second day in Monaco at the Fairmont Hotel, in front of which was a pretty special group of Ferraris. First of all, there was this 1 out of 499 Ferrari 458 Speciale Aperta finished in the launch spec with yellow, blue and white stripe. I have seen this exact car yesterday evening, but it looks so much better in the morning sun. And then there were these two very similar Ferrari 488 Pista from the Czech Republic. It is weird that I had to come all the way to Monaco to see Czech cars driving around. From there, I came down to the roundabout, where I just sat down and filmed cars driving past. Porsche 918 Spider. In front of Rolls-Royce showroom was a beautiful dark red Ferrari 812 Superfast with DDF wheels and exterior carbon. And at the Ferrari showroom was a squad of Rosso Corsa painted Ferraris. There was a 458 Speciale, F8 Tributo and a Ferrari 488 Challenge Evo, the first one I've ever seen. The Ferrari 488 Challenge Evo had its debut in the late 2019 and comes as a successor to the Ferrari 488 Challenge. It has the same 3.9-liter twin-turbocharged V8, producing 660 horsepower. However, thanks to all the aerodynamic tweaking, it produces 50% more downforce. And looks way more aggressive as well. I don't know how a Ferrari done it again, but the Evo just looks so much better than the standard challenge car. Just look at that massive front splitter, the side skirts and that rear wing, on which 5 people could easily eat their lunch. With all of these extra bits and bobs, the Ferrari 488 Challenge Evo can lap the Fiorano test circuit in 1 minute and 15 seconds, just 1 second slower than the Ferrari FXXK. And it only costs $370,000. What a bargain! I 
I am now in front of the Ferrari dealership here in Monte Carlo and I finally got a good view of the F8 Tributo that is here and finished in Rosso Corsa but not only this the more special car out of the bunch here is this Ferrari 488 Challenge Evo it is the first one that I've seen and it looks way more aggressive than the standard 488 Challenge with this front splitter here you can see it in naked carbon fiber and then these sort of fins over here which I have no idea I mean like I know what they're supposed to do probably some aerodynamics or something but they look just so weird on the car and then if we go from the back the back is sort of more reminiscent of the Pista than the standard uh, 488 because it's got this sort of vent going across the whole back of the car and of course a huge rear wing which is adjustable here you can see sort of how it can be adjusted and that's that and one funny thing that I've noticed while standing among all these Ferraris is that these three generations of Ferrari all share the same wing mirrors so here we've got the wing mirrors on the F8 Tributo which look like this then moving here to the back we've got the 458 Speciale which once again has got the exact same wing mirrors and then over to the side here we've got the 488 Challenge which has got, you guessed it, the same wing mirrors only this time there is this funny bit over here so yeah, that has been the 488 Challenge Evo back there and the FA Tributo and the 458 Speciale but now I'm going to move towards the city center and the roundabout where most cars drive by That's a 3 million Ferrari Enzo just driving past. In the back streets of Monaco, I have found this incredible 812 Superfast, finished in very, very dark green. And in front of the Le Meridien Hotel was this Italian Ferrari 488 Pista. Funnily enough, the 488 Pista also has a 3.9 liter twin turbocharged V8, same as the 488 Challenge Evo. But it is modded to produce 710 horsepower, so 50 more than the track focused race car. This is my first 992-911 Turbo S Spider. Didn't even know they started producing these already. Mm -hmm. 
In front of Cipriani, there was a Porsche 911 R, as well as a Lamborghini Aventador SV Roadster. But since it was already getting dark, I ended the spotting session there. All right, guys, and that is everything from today's video and the supercar spotting in Monaco. I am right now in the port. It is dark outside and I'm pretty tired, so I think I'm going to head to sleep. But if you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my YouTube channel for more automotive content. You know the drill. It means a lot to me. So just click that subscribe button and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Once again, that's everything for today and hopefully see you next time.